Good afternoon. It's a really beautiful day, quite windy, but the wind is kind of calming. I'm grateful for um, the time we get to spend together very briefly to pray. Thank you all for coming. The birds are out. <laughs> Today we're gonna start um, our prayers out with a psalm, Psalm 16, verses 5 through 11. The Lord is my chosen portion and my cup. You hold my lot. The boundary lines have fallen for me in pleasant places. I have a godly heritage. I bless the Lord who gives me counsel, and the night also my heart instructs me. I keep the Lord always before me because the Lord is at my right hand, I shall not be moved. Therefore, my heart is glad and my soul rejoices. My body also rests secure. For you do not give me up to Sheol or let your faithful one see the pit. You show me the path of life. In your presence, there is fullness of joy. In your right hand are pleasures forevermore. The Lord is my chosen portion and my cup. You hold my lot. The boundary lines have fallen for me and pleasant places. I have a, go a goodly heritage. I bless the Lord who gives me counsel in the night also my heart instructs me. I keep the Lord always before me because the Lord is at my right hand I shall not be moved. Therefore, my heart is glad and my soul rejoices. My body also rests secure. For you do not give me up to Sheol and let your faithful one see the pit. You show me the path of life. In your presence, there is fullness of joy. In your right hand are pleasures forevermore. think of uh, these words in the song we're going to uh, going to sing throughout our prayer. Um, and yesterday, hearing uh, conversations, the Festival of Homiletics is happening right now. They're, um, it's free for everyone to watch. Um, and there was a conversation um, around creation and um, this fear of God. And often when I think of fear of God, it's like, shame and judgment and um, <laughs> and all the things um, that are not great feelings. But uh, there was a little bit of uh, redirection for me yesterday when thinking about God's holiness and having a fear um, that is based in reverence and love of God. And um, so the Psalm really speaks about this trust that God um, is is holding us, that um, that our portion can come from God, that um, there is goodness in that space, um, and that we are being loved and protected. So I think of that also in re in reference to God's holiness and what it looks like to revere God, um, and knowing. I mean, look at the wind right? Look at these trees, look around us, knowing that this is all coming from our creator. There's something beautifully profound and humbling about it all. So I uh, leave that with you today as we start our prayers um, and gather together um, 
to revere God, to show our love for one another, to pray for those who need it. Pray for ourselves. Today's hymn is Holy, Holy, Holy. It's found in our ELW um, book. I always say ELW as if people know, in our worship book, um, 413. And it's found in other worship books as well. This is not just this one. So we'll start off with the song as we did yesterday, some quiet space, words of reflection, song, and then continue on, okay? Holy, 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 Lord God Almighty, early in the morning our song shall rise to be holy 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 merciful and mighty god in three persons blessed trinity god you are holy Hold us, remind us of who you are and whose we are. Guide us this day as we come to you in prayer, as we lift up those who need your guidance, your comfort, and your peace. Holy, 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 all the saints adore thee, casting down their golden crowns around the glassy sea, cherubim and Seraphim falling down before thee, which words and art and evermore shalt be. God, you are holy. Holy is your name. Above all leaders and all nations in our world, what you bring, what you give to us is life-giving. Guide our leaders. Give them the spirit of discernment. Open their hearts to do what is just and right in our world. Protecting all people. Holy, 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 though the darkness hide thee, though the eye of sinfulness thy glory may not see, only thou art holy. There is none beside thee, perfect. 
respect and power in love and purity. God, you are holy, and holy is your name. In the midst of all of this, of the confusion, the unknowns, the unfamiliar, you are our grounding place. In you we find grace and mercy in you we find love. We ask for that love to extend out to those in need, to those who are hurting or in pain, to any of us in this moment who need to hear that we are loved and cared for. Holy, 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 Lord God Almighty, all thy works shall praise thy name in earth and sky and sea. Holy, 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 merciful and mighty, God in three persons, blessed Trinity. We lift up all of our prayers, the ones we hold in our hearts, the ones we speak aloud, the ones that we can't even utter to this holy, holy God. In the name of Jesus Christ, amen. Go in peace, y'all. Thank you uh, all for showing up. Thank you for your consistency. And even in the moments where it's just like, maybe this is your first time or you've come once in a while, all of that is wonderful. And when you show up, um, we pray together, we get, gather together and that's beautiful and powerful. So I pray all of you for all of you to have a wonderful rest of your week. This is the mid point of our work week and uh, thank you all for being open to new ways of expressing our prayers together. Um, don't worry, we'll continue to have some familiarity in there. I uh, just sometimes wanna bring us into new spaces so that we can be open to what God is showing us. All right, enjoy the rest of your day. <laughs>